<laughs> Don't worry about the Knicks, because it's your boy Chris with the Knicks. Alright, so I just want to talk about the whole Rashida and Kirk situation of them being married and just um, the whole thing about that and the thought culture. Just uh, just a general topic. Just want to release something. Alright, so, uh, so, um, Kirk, so, uh, Kirk has re- uh, cheated on Rashida uh, numerous times, um, but she's tried to make it work. You know, she's a mother. I believe she's a grandmother as well. Yes, looking <laughs> young as hell. But in this generation, a lot of people get a crack in at an early age. And uh, I don't know, Kirk has um, cheated on her. And I saw the video of her and her best friend, uh, Jessica Dine, who... Um, when they was like explaining at the, uh, the all white party, uh, Treasure P, uh, I guess it's for Treasure Pussy, she uh, basically brought up, you know, tried to glamorify, oh, you know, I'm messing with a married man. And then Shashita was like, you know, why the fuck would you bring that up? Like, why would you, why would you bring that up? There was no reason for you to bring that up. So then that's when she bounced, and then that's when, um, and Jessica Dine ran over and snatched her $20 wig off <laughs> and her cheap uh, flip flops so, and then she was like you a grown woman she said yeah I'm a grown woman I'll beat your ass like your mama should have beat your ass you know and that's cool and I think that uh, and then some other person uh, that <clears throat> that Kirk messed around with just came out with a side piece of rap anthem now the song is bumping it's good but um it's good delivery the, she has talent but this whole side piece this whole whole um culture kind of needs to stop it i mean if you want to be a hoe if you want to sleep around that's cool both uh female and male however you know just uh, keep that to yourself you know i don't know why people trying to glamify being side chick i guess they hear songs like you know i'll be the other woman my little secret, uh, saving all my love for you, um, and then this song, you know, I don't feel like it's glamorous, you know, some people do take marriage seriously, a lot of us are old school, you know, marriage is a sacred thing, you know, it's forever, this is a person that, you know, you walk through the desert heat, you climb the mountains, highest peak, you'll swim the, um, the oceans, deepest sea. Yes, I got that from Brandy, put that on everything, but like I said, some people take their marriage very seriously, and for you, for people to be trying to glamorify being side piece and side chicks, I don't think, you know, that, you know, in the song, I guess that's okay, but again, you know, music sometimes imitate real life, it's like all that death rap and all that ghetto stuff, it needs to stop, you know, a lot of people want to talk about Tupac and Biggie, you know, they told they told stories of you to, like, you know, stay away from that. You know, this is what can happen if you about that life. You know, they called it them thugs, but they wasn't really a thug in like in a menace sense. They was actually very enlightened. Hence, why they probably you know was set up. <coughs> you know, so and then for this whole side piece thing, you know, like Tyree said, you know, you're gonna put some knowledge down there. And for y'all to say, oh, well, men do it too. Yes, there is a lot of hoe ass niggas. You know, there was some, I was, well, ex friends with some. You know, those are the type of dudes I would not bring my girl around because I would not bring my girl around them because, um, for sure, they will, um, they're the type of dudes that, uh, sneak behind your back and try to get her another. You know, I've known, I know a lot of people. Oh, you know, she's in a relationship, so. What the fuck you mean, so? And then I've known girls who um, try to get with the guy who has a girlfriend. Like, oh, well, you know. Oh, yeah, I have a girlfriend. Oh, well, you can have your side piece. I remember hearing that when I was in middle school. Somebody told me, you know. Oh, you can have you some on the side. That is so rude and disrespectful. Like, I don't find that cute. And I don't find that attractive. If you want to play around, mess around, stay single. 
unless you're in an open relationship. But if you're in a monogamous relationship, you should stay monogamous. I believe in monogamous. Like, if you want friends with benefits, then stay single. If you know you're going to be playing out on somebody, stay single. You know, don't be just having somebody there be your ride or die. And then, you know, while you go out and mess, up, mess around with other people, and they go do the same thing, and then you want to talk mess. And so Rashida should dog him out, or just divorce him. She should creep. Or just divorce him, you know. I just think this whole side thing, side piece, um, <coughs> uh, whole culture, you know, let me bust it open for people, you know. Ain't nobody going to take you serious when you, when you want to get in a real relationship. You know, because you want to have fun now, but eventually you're going to want to settle down. <coughs> and, you know, who's going to want to settle down with you after you've been messed around? Are you known as a mess around? Both male and female. Because most, like like with Drake, a lot of females probably don't take him seriously. Like, hell no, you done been in with all these women. You know, I don't know if you're going to settle down or cheat, cheat on me. You know, like I said, I don't have biased opinions. You know, I don't have biased opinions. You know, I talk about both both sides. The only thing different with females is that females obviously can get laid faster. Because, you know, dudes are thirsty as hell. That's the only thing. Well, I put more emphasis on females because, you know, they have the power to say yes and they have the power to say no. All right, so any comments, questions, concerns, leave in the comment section below. Till then, this has been your boy, Chris with the next. Peace.